Holy crap! <laughs> oh my god. There appears to be salmon here. <laughs> I'm out here fishing for trout. If I actually hook a salmon on a six weight and trout gear, I'm gonna be in trouble. Holy crap! <laughs> oh my god. This guy. It's crazy. Ugh, some of the darker sides of doing what we're doing. I don't know why somebody would just they would just leave these fish just here dead. There's probably four that are dead. That's crazy. It's like, come on, guys. Why is that necessary? So I'm unclear of why somebody would do that. Maybe they're just selectively trying to take home bigger fish, but man, what a waste to see all these dead fish that were obviously caught and killed. That's too bad. Ooh, had a hit. Really a cool river. Did not anticipate there being th this many salmon. So consequently, it's probably pushed the Sea Run Cutthroat and Cutthroat out of the river because there's so many salmon. But along with that, there are a ton of people. I mean, just a absolute ton of people. I mean, it's, it is super crowded and just something I'm not used to. And just the amount of garbage and discarded stuff and lures and dead fish. I mean, it's kind of, it's a little bit disheartening if I'm completely being honest. I try to be responsible and pick up trash and you know, I don't leave a trace when I'm out fishing so it's kind of tough to see what I'm seeing on this river. It's really, it's really too bad. But I'm gonna keep hiking up to see if I can find some solitude and maybe a couple of fish. All right, let's do this fish home. Well, I came for the trout. I found an absolute ton of salmon, uh, even more fishermen a whole bunch of trash, dead fish, carcasses, but at least I got a few cans in the bucket so I can take that back at least. I did a small part in cleaning up, but the whole combat fishing, not my scene, but I had to try, right? I made a long drive, beautiful river, just packed. All right, till next time, everybody, fish on.